In this video, we will look at how to apply multiple workflows to the same project with workflow scheme. Workflow schemes let you map workflows to issue types. This means every issue type in a project can have its own workflow. Now, as we can see, for our test project, both bug issues and also task issues, they all share the same workflow. So what we will do is to create a different workflow for bugs. So they need to go through an extra testing step while tasks can stay the same. Now the first thing we have to do is to go to workflows and create a new bug workflow. Now instead of creating one from scratch, we can simply copy the default Jira workflow and then make a few modifications. Now the first change is to remove some of the transitions going from open and in progress to resolved and closed so that the issue would have to go through the proper process. The second step is to add a new in-test step to our workflow. And then add a new transition going from in progress to in test. And another transition going from in test to resolve. Now that we have created our new workflow, the next step is to go to workflow schemes and then click on add workflow scheme to create our new bug task workflow scheme. Now once we have created our new workflow scheme, we can start assigning workflows to issue types. So we'll click on add workflow, add existing, select our new bug workflow, and then select the bug issue type. Now when assigning workflows to issue types, there's a all unassigned issue types option, which represent all issue types that do not have specific workflow assignment. In this case, we will assign all issue types that are not bug to the task workflow. So now, as you can see, for bug issues, the bug workflow will be applied. And for all other issue types, the task workflow will be applied. So now that we have made our issue types and workflow assignment, the last step is to apply the workflow scheme to project. Now to do this, we first go to the project, click on administration, and then workflows, switch scheme, and then select our new bug task workflow scheme. Now when changing workflow scheme, Jira will run a quick compare of the current workflows and the new workflows. And if you find any missing statuses, in this case, the in backlog status is missing for the bug workflow, we can map any issues that are currently in the in backlog status to a new status that exists in the bug workflow. So in this case, we will change that to the open status. Now, once the change is completed, we can go back and we can see for bug issues, we're now using our new bug workflow where we have this new in test step. And for tasks, we can see we are still using the old task workflow. Now, before we finish, the last thing we will look at is that Jira also allows us to directly assign workflows to issue type from within the project, and we automatically create a workflow scheme if there isn't one. All you have to do is to click on Add Workflow, Add Existing, select the workflow you want, and then select the issue type you want to assign it to. And there, we have just assigned the default Jira workflow to the test case issue type.